Hello everyone this is Sampath in the today video tutorial I am going to show how to use split valuation in material master okay without any further ado let's get started firstly we need to understand what is split valuation in split valuation we can evaluate same material in different ways for example same material we can produce internally in house production or externally in this case we can evaluate the same material in different ways firstly create the material to create the material go to the transaction code mm01 here i am using internal number range enter your industrial sector and material type now press enter key select all required views now press enter key enter all required organization data now press enter key enter the material description i am going to enter raw material enter unit of measure unit of measure i am going to enter pc enter material group now press enter key press enter key just fill the all the mandatory fields enter 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 transportation group enter loading group enter material group in purchasing view enter mrp type pd mrp controller and lot search planned delivery time i'm going to enter 10 days maintain schedule margin key yes here enter the valuation class and maintain the valuation category here in first case i'm going to maintain the valuation category b okay now press enter key enter enter finally save the material master i am just copying the material master now i am going to create purchase order here i have few cases okay that i am going to show now okay without maintaining the valuation type i am going to creating the purchase order why that i will explain go to the transaction code me 21 n enter your vendor master paste the copied material here enter quantity quantity i am going to enter 100 delivery date system automatically takes from material master value i am going to enter 12 euro enter plant now enter the storage location 301 now press enter key see here system by default taken the valuation type how it's taken still we are not extended this material to this valuation type still it is coming by default how it is coming by default that i will explain okay now go to the transaction slash n om sorry slash o slash o o m w c okay now press enter key so before that just copy this valuation type okay press enter key now click on cancel button okay here click on global categories here in material master we maintained valuation category b okay when i maintain the valuation category b by default in the purchase order system shows this valuation type okay so just keep cursor on the b now click on change option see here by default purchase order taken this valuation type okay now come back to our purchase order now click on check 
save this purchase order now i am going to release the purchase order to release purchase order i am going to use me29 in transaction now click on other purchase order option maintain our purchase order number press enter key go to the header release the purchase order save it okay now i am going to do the gr still i am not extended my material master to valuation type we'll see whether system allows or not to do the gr maintain the purchase order number press enter key click on item okay check box now click on check yes system showing the error without extending the material master to valuation type system don't allow to post the gr okay and here one more important point system automatically takes the valuation type from purchase order okay here it is not possible to change the valuation type okay why because it is already maintained in the purchase order now i am going to extend my material to this valuation type to extend my material master to valuation type i need to use the transaction mm01 now press enter key enter your material master press enter key press enter key here mention your valuation type my valuation type is this one here i selected all views system automatically skips those views it goes to the accounting one view now press enter key just ignore the warning message yes yeah so here this is raw material okay let's see which valuation class system suggest yeah here system suggesting 7900 valuation class why because that i will show it this setting in the configuration system here don't takes the valuation class from material type it takes the valuation class from valuation type okay just maintain the valuation type sorry valuation class okay now go to the transaction code omwc now press enter key just click on cancel click on global types just find your valuation type so my valuation type is this one this valuation type is assigned to account category reference 3008 now keep cursor on the valuation type now click on change option here we can observe account category reference is 3008 this account category reference is assigned to valuation class 7900 just click on account category reference see here my account category reference 3008 is assigned to 7900 and 7910 valuation class so because of this reason material master taking the this valuation class okay i am repeating again in split valuation system takes the valuation class from valuation type not from material type now come back to our material master just save it yes i saved my material master and i successfully extended to my valuation type okay we can check this one in mm60 now press enter key just execute it yes my material master successfully extended to valuation type okay now we can do the gr go to the transaction code mgo enter your purchase order number 
yeah by default it is taking the evaluation type from purchase order now select item okay checkbox click on check now post it now we can check the accounting entries click on fa document push button double click on accounting documents yes stock account gets debited and parallelly jrr account get credited okay in second case i am going to create a material master with different valuation category in first case i used valuation category b in second case i am going to use valuation category c okay go to the transaction code mm01 press enter key press enter key just create the material master as usual in accounting one view i am going to maintain valuation category c now maintain the valuation type sorry valuation class press enter key press enter key finally save it copy the material master go to the transaction code me21n to create purchase order still i am not extended my material master to valuation type okay why that i will explain okay now enter vendor master enterprise enter plant enter storage location see here system taken the valuation type c1 okay but it is in editable mode earlier case it is in non editable mode why let me explain okay go to the transaction code om wc now press enter key click on cancel here click on global categories here my category is c just keep cursor on this yeah so here by default we maintain the c1 for external valuation type and c2 for internal valuation type okay just click on change yes so here i am not selected default value indicator so that is the reason in purchase order it is showing in editable mode okay now we can extend the material master to our particular valuation type to extend as usual go to the transaction code mm01 slash n mm01 now press enter key enter your material master press enter key enter enter valuation type c1 enter just click on right mark yes it automatically skipped the already maintained views okay it is extending to particular valuation type so here also we can observe different valuation class why because it is depend upon the valuation type okay not depend on the material type enter 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 finally save it okay now go back to purchase order save the purchase order copy it so before releasing the purchase order i will show how it taken the valuation class for particular material type go to the transaction code om wc press enter key click on cancel click on global type here my valuation type is c1 
this one it assigned to account category reference 3003 okay now click on change option click on account category reference 3003 account category reference is assigned to valuation class 3040 okay hence in material master system taken the valuation class 3040 okay now we can continue to do the gr select goods receipt enter purchase order number press enter key sorry my purchase order is not released i am going to release me 29 in click on other purchase order enter your purchase order number press enter key go to header release purchase order save it now go to the gr screen by clicking the space bar we can select the recently entered data or value press enter key click on item ok this valuation type system taken from the purchase order if we maintain the valuation type in purchase order in goods receipt screen it is not possible to edit click on check enter story location now click on post check and post yes now we can check the accounting entries click on accounting document double click ok that's it today video tutorial if you have the any suggestions or any queries please comment me thank you